There are an unfortunate number of people currently living around the world who are experiencing some of the rarest, weirdest diseases known to man. Some of these are probably unheard of by many of you, but they do exist, and they are affecting the daily lives of those who are unlucky enough to have come down with the symptoms. There are treatments in some cases, but not all are so lucky. In fact, the majority have no known treatment and they still baffle doctors everywhere. Number 10. Epidermodysplasia verruciformis, also known as dream and illness, is extremely rare and genetic. Patients feature an abnormal, red-brown macules on the face, neck, and body. Some cases feature lesions limited to only one extremity. Unfortunately, no serious treatment for epidermodysplasia verruciformis has been found. Treatments have been suggested, though excisions tend to be the best option available. Number 9. Fibrodysplasia ossificans progressiva has been called the stone man syndrome. This rare disease is found within the connective tissue of the body, and is known as a mutation of the body's repair mechanism. This, unfortunately, causes fibrous tissue to regrow as bone when damaged. Sufferers are slowly imprisoned by the skeleton within their own body. There is no known cure for the disease. Number 8. Polydactylism, or the disease where extra fingers or toes are present on the body, is considered to be one of the more common diseases within the development of birth. One out of every 500 children have polydactylism. The extra finger or toe tends to be nothing more than soft tissue with no bone. Surgery to remove the extra digit is the only option. Number 7. Proteus syndrome, otherwise known as Weidmann syndrome, causes skin overgrowth and atypical bone development within the human body. Tumors tend to cover the majority of the body of those afflicted. Teams of doctors in Australia have tested a drug to help patients affected by Proteus syndrome, which has been found to be an effective treatment option. Number 6. Werewolf syndrome, most commonly known as hypertrichosis, is known for the growth of hair over the majority of the body. There are two known types, including generalized, covering the entire body, and localized, which covers a very specific area. There is no cure, however, but you can manage the symptoms in patients. Temporary hair removal can last from several hours to several weeks. Number 5. Porphyria, is a rare group of inherited or acquired diseases that should help in the production of porphyrins and heme. Abdominal pain, vomiting, neuropathy, and mental disturbances tend to be the most common symptoms. The origin of vampires comes from porphyria, as patients have trouble facing the sunlight. There is no cure, though treatment for each disease within the group is possible. Number 4. Lion Face Syndrome, otherwise known as Leontius Isossi, is incredibly rare. This is characterized by an overgrowth of the facial and cranial bones. Technically, Leontius Isossi is not a disease itself, but a symptom of other diseases combined. The increased size of the face hinders the abilities of the mouth, nose and its sinuses. Complete loss of sight is common as the optic nerve is crushed by bone. Number 3. Progeria is incredibly rare, occurring in only 1 per 8 million births. The rare disorder resembles aspects of aging, and manifest at an early age. Skin changes, abnormal growth, and loss of hair are the most common symptoms of progeria. No treatment has ever proved to be effective, unfortunately. Most treatments simply focus on reducing any problems those afflicted are experiencing instead. Number 2. Haley Haley disease is known for the blisters and lesions that appear on the victim's skin. These usually come and go, but heal without any scarring. After puberty, those with Haley Haley disease will begin to notice the blisters and lesions occurring on the surface of their skin. Symptoms can develop at any age. However, unfortunately, there are no antibodies to fight this genetic disease. Number 1. 
Lamprey disease was one of the most terrifying diseases said to be spreading among the human population. However, it was later revealed to be an email hoax that preyed on those who would be particularly grossed out by the idea of a body part being replaced by the mouth of a lamprey. It was said to feature a toothed, funnel-like sucking mouth on various body parts, such as in the eye, 